Hi, in this video, I'll be looking at Kessel and Berger's Statistical Inference Chapter 1 Problem 3 Solution. Right. Finish the proof of Theorem 1.1.4 for any events A, B, C, and D defined on a sample space S. Show that A union B is equal to B union A and A intersection B is equal to B intersection A. Right. So we'll, first we'll start with the first one that is A union B is equal to B union A. I'm trying to prove this. Okay. Right. First, I'll start with let X be an element of A union B. I'll put double arrows because we can go both ways. So this means X is an element of A O. X is an element of B because union means O. Okay. So, I can change those two and write the same thing as x is an element of B or x is an element of A. And this is same as telling x is an element of B union A, which gives you A union B is the same identity as B union A. Okay, right. Next, A intersection B is equal to B intersection A. I'll start from the left hand side. Let x be an element of A intersection B. What does this tell you? Intersection means and. Okay. Right. So this is x is an element of A and x is an element of B. I can write the same thing as x is an element of B and x is an element of A. So this is same as writing x is an element of B intersection A. This tells you A intersection B is the same identity as B intersection A. Okay, right. So this is commutativity, right. So next we'll look at associativity. All right. <clears throat> okay. So first I'll start with this one that is a union bracket b union c is same as a union b union c okay i'll start from the left hand side let x be an element of a union b union c and this is here again union means o so this is same and writing x is an element of a o x is an element of b union c all right so we we'll go one more step this is same as writing x is an element of a o here again this is a union which means o so this is telling you x is element of b o x is an element of c now <clears throat> i can combine these two and write x is an element of a union b so O means union, so I'll just replace replace it by union. X is an element of a union B O. X is an element of C. So again, I'll replace this O with the union, so I end up with X is an element of a union B union C. So we have proved the identity that is a union B union C is same as a union B union C. Okay, now we look at the next one. Now I have to do the same thing with intersection. A intersection, B intersection C is equal to A intersection B intersection C. Right, I'll start with the left hand side. Let X be an element of A intersection B intersection C. I'll put double arrows so because we can go like both ways. This is X is an element of A and Intersection means and so this is and x is an element of b intersection c. Right. Nothing happens to this x is an intersection of a. This is and again this is an intersection which can be replaced by an and so this is telling you x is an element of b and x is an element of c as well. Now I can combine these two and write. X, since this is since x is an element of a and 
x is an element of b i can write the same thing as x is an element of a intersection b and x is an element of c now again this is m sign which can be replaced by an intersection so this is same as telling x is an element of a intersection b intersection c right so we have proved the identity a intersection b intersection c is equal to a intersection b intersection c so we'll go to the next one now we have to prove the de Morgan's laws right so these are really useful stuff right first i'll try to prove this one that is a union b complement is same as a complement intersection b complement okay so that is, this is what i'm trying to prove now i'll start from here let x be an element of a union b complement we know that if x is an element of a complement this tells you that x is not an element of a okay right so this tells you x is not an element of a union b right so if something is not a part of union let's say this is a this is b so x is not here x is definitely not in this union so what does that tell you x is definitely not an element of a and x is definitely not an element of b why because if x was an element of either a or b like it would be in the union but like here we are telling x is not in the union therefore x is not an element of a and x is not an element of b right so now this tells you since x is not an element of a this tells you x is definitely an element of a complement and from here you can write x is definitely an element of b complement now we have and in the middle so this means x is definitely an element of a complement intersection b complement because it belongs to both a complement and b complement so this tells you a union b complement these two identities are the same a complement intersection b complement right next <clears throat> next we look at how to prove a intersection b complement is equal to a complement union b complement okay i'll start from the left hand side again let x be an element of a intersection b complement right so what does this tell you again like using this thing right so this tells you x is definitely not an element of a intersection b okay so <clears throat> again we look at what is intersection this is this is a and this is b right now x is x is not in the middle <clears throat> how can that happen maybe it was because x was not an element of a or it can be because x was not an element of b we don't know we don't know for sure which was the case right it's definitely because either it was x was not an element of a or x was not an element of b right if they were elements of both a and b it would be here but like it's not the case now right so now this tells you x is definitely an element of a complement or x is definitely an element of b complement so, so this gives you or can be replaced by union so this is same as telling a x is an element of a complement union b complement so now we have proved the identity a intersection b complement is same as writing a complement union b complement All right thank you if you guys have any questions you can just put post it in the comments or just put a link i'll make a video to address your issues okay thank you